Hey guys, today we're going to be reviewing the iMovie for iPad. It's going to be a quick tutorial, show you the basic things of iMovie. So what you're going to do is you're going to download the app, and then you're going to open it up, then it'll view all of the projects that you have, and then I'm going to hit this plus button for a new project. You can do a new a movie or a trailer. I'm gonna show you a, the movie, and then as you can see, you got a bunch of different themes. Um, I don't really know what mine's gonna be, so I guess I'll just go with simple. <coughs> then you're gonna get, hit create movie. So you can you got three little options down here. You can. You can film straight from the iPad camera to insert it into your timeline. You got this microphone to record to record audio separately and add it into your timeline while the movie is playing. And then this is your settings. Oops. So what you can do is, like each theme has its own theme music, so you can turn that theme music on. You can... You can fade in from black, you can fade out to black, you can speed changes pitch, which comes with that on. I don't know what music I'm going to add yet, so I'm just going to shut that off. So, so we're going to start by filming from iMovie. It should come to this, which is the camera. So I'm just going to film this. Okay, now that's done, and you're going to hit use video, and it takes a while for it to process and get it right in the timeline. So now, as we see, you can play it well right from the editing screen. And I'm going to show you how to add titles. So you're going to do, it's just for that scene, so you're going to do this, you're going to go title. Then you get you got opening. That's a title theme, middle and closing. That's I don't know why sometimes it does this, but you're just gonna go. So yeah, right, this is closing. This is middle. I don't know why it does that. Oh, we're just gonna back. I'm just and then you're gonna tap on that to add a title. So I'm just gonna say my. iMovie video for iMovie tutorial. Now you can hit done and then it'll come up like this. And then you you can add music. So to add music, you go to audio. Then you got theme music. You can add sound effects. Then you and then you can do, and then you can take a bunch of songs. Oops, that's artist. Bunch of songs you've downloaded, and then some of them are available. Some of them are not. I guess it depends on what platform you buy them or download them on. I'm not quite sure how this works. And and then iMovie also gives you a bunch of songs so you can go to theme music and then and then the theme music that they give you is all of the themes that iMovie has for your video. So you got my camera doesn't focus very well so I'll just read it. Bright, I report, modern, neon, news, playful, simple, and travel. Sorry about this. This is a camera on my dad's phone, so it doesn't work too well. And then, so let's just say we want to add the neon music, and then you can play it.
So I just want to add that, so you're going to hit that arrow, and now this is the project so far. Whoops. Whoops. Oh, I guess I accidentally hit modern instead of neon. My mistake. So, whoops, not sound effects. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Theme music, neon. So now you got neon. And let's say I want to add a photo. It'll just play straight photos. And then you got camera roll and my photo stream. And you got, you got a bunch of different. You might have different things you've downloaded your photos onto. So you got all my pictures. Let's just say I'm going to add this one of Play Money. And then there's the transition where it's like, Kind of like that, but let's say I don't like that. This is what it looks like. Let's say I don't like it like that. You got a bunch of different ones you can choose from. I want to do this one, so this is what this that looks like. So that I like it that like that. And then if you go to video, you can also take in all things that you've done before. In, in insert them so let's just say this is me dancing let's just say I want to insert that to my timeline and then you can also if you download this app stop animator it it's a stop motion app if you haven't seen my stop motion video tutorial then check it out then you'll know more about stop motion. So let's just say I want to upload this stop motion of a four wheeler. I can just insert it. And let's say I want to change the transition again. Let's say I want this. And then for this one, let's say I want this, which is just a straight, it doesn't really do anything. It just goes boop, boop. Kind of like that. And then, so yeah, now I'll show you the microphone that you can record from, which is right here. And you can record. This is my iMovie tutorial video. And then you can review it. This is my iMovie tutorial video. Then you can retake it or cancel it you can accept it so this I'll go like this this is my iMovie tutorial video So that was the quick and basic things about iMovie. I'll show you how to add sound effects. You go to sound effects. Then it gives you a bunch of different ones that you can choose from. Let's just, in, it inserts at the beginning of wherever your timeline is. So let's just say I want to insert one right here. Yeah, okay, let's do cartoon ascending. I think that's what it says. <laughs> so then it'll sound like this. So yeah, those are just the basic things about iMovie. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope it will help you. If you want to title your movie, instead of My Movie 10, I'm going to change it to My iMovie Tutorial Video. And then you can also make trailers. But I'll show you that in a different video because this video is obviously getting long. 
So that is iMovie. I hope you enjoyed seeing what goes into this iMovie for iPad. It's a, in my opinion, it's a lot easier to use than the computer version. But that was my iMovie tutorial video. So thanks for watching.